simply learn. Your pace, your place. Financial Risk Manager, FRM. Part 1 of the FRM exam covers the fundamental tools and techniques used in risk management and the theories that underlie their use. Black Skull's Merton Model. Welcome to the 40th lecture in your preparation for the FRM exam. In the last session, we learned to price the option using the binomial model. However, we have used discrete steps of only six months or one year for each change in the price of the option. In this session, we will learn about the Black Skulls Merton model that is based on a continuous change in the price of the option. Agenda the Black Skulls Merton model will be the main agenda of our discussion. We will first begin by discussing stock price and return distributions. We will then discuss the assumptions underlying the model. We will then learn to compute the European option using this model. We will also see how Black's approximation can be used to evaluate American options that pay dividends. Finally, we will end the session by deriving the value of the volatility implied by the market value of the option using the same Black Skulls Merton model. Stock Price and Return Distributions Let us begin our session by first learning about stock price distributions. We have earlier studied that the stock price follows a log normal distribution. A log normal distribution is shown in the slide. It has a positive skew. The property of a log normal function is such that its logarithm follows a normal distribution, as in the second chart. The logarithm of the stock price follows a normal distribution with the parameters as given in the slide, which is a function of the stock price at the initial time, the expected return on the stock, the volatility of the stock, and the time to expiry. The expected return from a stock is given by the formula on the right side which is the initial stock price multiplied by E raised to the power of mu T. The mean return on a stock is a function of the expected return on the stock and the volatility. Realized return and historical volatility. Realized return is calculated as a geometric mean return across the period. For example, we can compute the geometric return of the last five years' stock return to arrive at the annualized realized return. 